Well, when I came to Minnesota in 2001, I was the director of marketing. I had a chance to advance to the Associate AD for External Affairs, and it gave me a chance to see many different parts of the program, and that's where I had my first inclination I wanted to be an athletic director. So I really consider Minnesota the foundation of my career as I moved forward and went to Kentucky, and then to Boise State as the athletic director in Syracuse. So that was a very special time for me, and I learned a lot during that tenure. From my time here before to now, you know, I think you learn every every day. And, and what I've learned here is your number one asset is your people. And you want to find people who understand the core mission of our program. You know, the core mission of our program is to provide a first class experience for all of our student athletes. And, and Minnesota has great people on staff. You know, we take great pride working here. We take great pride in representing this institution in the state. And what I've learned and what I would apply now is how can I make sure we surround ourselves with great people, great people who care about our students, great people who care about our, our ticket holders, our donors, and so forth. And again, this is a special place and we need to talk about that. You know, there's three or four people that had a real big impact on my career. Obviously, I had a chance to work with Joel Maturi closely, and Joel taught me a great deal about character integrity. And then I went to the University of Kentucky working with Mitch Barnhart, their athletic director. You know, he was named Athletic Director of the Year last year across the country. He's highly respected, and to be able to learn from him firsthand, also spending time with John Calipari with Kentucky Basketball, uh, exposed me to big-time college athletics, big-time college basketball, if you will, and then working with Chris Peterson at Boise State, you know, talking about how you treat people and how the number one asset you have is your people. You know, in this past year at Syracuse, working with Jim Beheim and others, I really learned a great deal about what it takes to compete at a high level and how it requires all of us to be in and all of us to support the program. Well, as the director of athletics in Minnesota, I think the biggest impact I can have is be de being defined by my actions. You know, we can talk all the time about things we want to do and what we want to accomplish, but your actions define you. So, you know, we don't, we don't want to talk about it, we want to be about it. And I'm hopeful that my actions will show that we care deeply for all of our programs, we care deeply for the people who invest in our program, and we want to invest in them and make sure we provide that great experience for all student-athletes.